hey everyone so in this video i am going to share one solution of an error uh, that you might be facing uh, that is course error so course stand for cross origin resource sharing so this error comes when you are trying to fetch some resources some data from your server side application so uh, this is uh, this error come due to a security reason so uh, let's get started and we will discuss the solution so, for so here you can see that i have used front end as an uh, react application so if you are using uh, some other front end uh, frameworks then it's okay uh, uh, till the till you are using your back end application as an uh, node and express so here you can see i have i am using node and express here as my back end so from the from back end server i have sent some data and i want to try i am i am trying to fetch some data these data to my fr uh, front end from uh, using the fetch function so uh, when i'm trying to fetch function so this error comes you can see here like uh, i have started my uh, react application so you, you can see that access to fetch this error comes when i try to access i trying to fetch the data from the this uh, from the server from the url so how i can resolve this issue so basically this issue is very simple i we have to simply install course uh, course module which comes uh in react simply uh i will go to my server and uh, i have opened my uh, terminal so first of all i will close the server so uh, in my server.js i will install npm i course So you can see here that I have installed my course. So now how, how we will use? So simply we will first we will require course, and after that we will use that. So you can see. Yeah. So basically, I have I have used here my course. So basically, in course, you have put my origin as in my uh, the my endpoint. So whatever endpoints you are using for the front end part, like here, my endpoint is localhost three thousand. So you have to put here. So after that, you can see that I will refresh it. Oh, sorry, I have not started my server side application. So first of all, I have to start. So I have started my and I will refresh it. Okay, so server side. Okay, so you can see here that I am getting the data. So okay, this data I am getting. After fetching, so you can, you can see here, I have fetched and consoled the consoled it the data. So it is very sensitive. So you can see that I I I had an uh, slash here. So this also, uh, but this all this was also not allowing it. So simply you can also do is that we can keep an as asterisk. So this asterisk will allow from everywhere. So anyone can access uh, our resources, our server resources. So we will uh, check it once working or not so so yes it's working like uh, you can see that i have fetched i have got my data okay so this was basically simple solution so basically uh, you can install course use course and you can write this much of code and you can solve your issue so that's it for the video if you have, have any query so you can comment down below i will try to resolve and also i will put some links into my description for your reference so thank you that's uh, that's all for the video and keep subscribing keep uh, and if you find useful please like the video thank you